In this Photoshop tutorial, I'm going to show you how to delete recent files from your home screen. So when you open Photoshop and you don't have a project open, you'll see this recent files list. You can sort it by recent, name size, or kind, descending or ascending order, and you can also filter. You can also list them or show the thumbnails. Now, I find this list really useful when you're trying to get back to a file you recently had open. However, sometimes we want to remove specific ones, or maybe you just want to clear this entire list. Unfortunately, we cannot just right click on these to unpin them or remove them. The one manual method you could do to remove these is to go and move, delete, or rename the file. I know this is kind of a pain. If you're really looking to individually delete one, you can. I'm going to go down to Finder, and I have, for instance, this screenshot and then this animals JPEG. The screenshot JPEG, if I click on it and just rename it, I'm just going to remove a letter from the name. Once I rename that and come back here and click on this, it's going to say that the file can't be opened. Once it can't be opened, it will remove it from the list. So I could go and move one of these files. I could rename them. I could do anything to sort of break that link, and it will remove it from the list individually. So that's one way to do that. That's a silly way to do that, but if you're really looking to do that, you can. You can also remove all of these recent files just by going up to File, Open Recent, and at the bottom, we can clear the recent file list. Once we do that, we have no more recent files. And so then you can open whatever you want, clear that list whenever you want, or move items around to remove individual recent files from that list. That's how you can remove or delete recent files here in Photoshop.